These are two Lenovo Legion Slim 5 laptops. This one has the 8840 or 8845, and this has the 7735. The screens are both identical, 350 nits of max brightness, and they were booted up at the same time. However, the newer one boots about half a dozen seconds faster so far. We're gonna see if the Wi-Fi is the same. Here is the Wi-Fi connecting. Looks like they are basically identical for connecting to Wi-Fi. Both of them are searching for updates. However, it seems like this one is just a little bit ahead. We're gonna see how many seconds it takes for the other one to restart. I'm gonna go ahead and pause it until they restart again. Okay, it looks like the Legion logo just came up on the right and now on the left. We'll see what boot time is like. So looks like about 10 seconds before it was able to get to the same screen. Looks like they might be restarting again after naming the PC. This is the second reboot. The 8000 series is finished. It looks like that was about, not quite there yet, 14 seconds of difference between the two. Just clicked to set up as a new PC and we are creating a pin now. We have just created the pin code now. At this point, we have declined as much of the Microsoft cruft as we could and made it through a bunch of advertising. So now it looks like we are updating to the latest version of Windows so they can start collecting as much data as possible and advertising to their users. But we will see which of these is faster and what the battery life is at once both of these have finished updating. This is the Lenovo Legion with the 8845 CPU, and it has completed updating battery life. Let's see what we're looking at here. So the one on the right, the 8000 series Ryzen, has finished setting everything up and is logged in. And the one on the left is still finishing its last reboot, and then it's going to take about another minute for it to complete the first login. So, noticeably better over here just on boot times and things like that. I'm not sure if there's an SSD difference. Um, maybe I will have to look at that in the system settings because this is still finishing up. And so far, it seems like there's a significant improvement somewhere on the 8000 series Legion Slim 5 versus the 7000 series Ryzen. So you can see here, this is the 7000 series. And this one says Ryzen 7, but it is the 8000 series if we go into the settings. So here we are looking at the CPU, which is the 8845HS with the 780M graphics. Both have 16 gigs of RAM. And on that first login, looks like we are at 83% with an hour and 49 minutes remaining. I'm guessing that's just because the install was pretty heavy on CPU and disk usage. And this is the 7000 series now, so here are the specifications here so this is a 7735hs and battery life we are looking at 80 percent remaining saying two hours and 16 minutes
Hardware info is now running on both of these and logging the system information, the battery discharge rate, while a very long YouTube video plays about 12 hours. Um, do have ads because I didn't want to sign in and ruin anything. Uh, we can see some of the data here on the Ryzen 8000 series. Um, it does seem like from time to time it's about one watt lower if you look at the charge rate, which is a negative right now, but sometimes that'll be at 19 instead of negative 20, whereas the other one is often negative 20, but it looks like at this point for the 7000 series we have the charge rate at negative 19 and a half, so it'll be interesting to see if one of these lasts longer than the other. Looks like the Ryzen 7000 series is at 55%, and it's saying two and a half hours remaining, and the Ryzen 8000 series is at 62%, with about three hours remaining. So once tomorrow rolls around, we will know. The screens are both at half brightness, the volume is on two, both are connected to the same Wi-Fi, are on the same version of Windows. They've installed Windows. They have run a little bit of a OpenGL fishbowl demo for about half an hour. And now they are on the light use case, just running a YouTube video until the battery dies. Here is the final report on battery life for these two machines, the Lenovo Legion Slim 5 with the 8845 on the right and the 7730 on the left. Battery life was very similar. So running YouTube overnight, the 8845 lasted until 316 AM and the 7735 lasted until 244 AM. So only getting about half an hour extra battery life. And when we look at the battery remaining, it looks like it's estimating about that as well. So. With 98% battery life with just Excel open, we're getting four hours and 38 minutes on the 7735, and five hours and 12 minutes on the 8845. So about half an hour difference of battery life. And just to review, that was running YouTube on a really long video after both of these had finished installing uh, Windows setting up, doing the first login, and running for about half an hour the Aquarium 3D benchmark on web browsers if you type in OpenGL Aquarium for the fish. So hopefully that helps answer people's questions about battery life differences between these two. Uh, both of these are on sale, very small price difference. Uh, so I would say just get the newer CPU if you can. Other than that, they're identical, although the newer CPU does have about a 20% performance uplift, even if the battery life is not improved very much.